For time t less than zero, S1 is closed and S2 is open. At t equal to zero, S1 is opened and S2 is closed. If the initial voltage across the capacitor, that means C2 is zero at t equal to zero, we are asked to find out what is the voltage across capacitor combination at t equal to zero plus. So we will solve this problem by drawing equivalent circuits to make it easier to understand. So for t less than zero, we have S1 closed and S2 open. So this will be the equivalent circuit. We have a three volt here and one farad capacitance here. So for t less than zero, the switch S1 was closed. So the capacitor will charge to a potential of three volts. Now, when S1 is opened and S2 is closed, what happens? We have one farad in parallel with the two farad capacitance. Now we are asked to find out what is the potential across this combination. Okay. Now we are going to apply the charge conservation law. That is we have three volt one farad. We know that the charge stored in the capacitor will be CV coulombs. That is one farad into three volts. That is three coulombs. Now, same charge will be equally distributed across this combination of capacitance. What is the equal capacitance when one farad and two farad are connected in parallel? We have one farad parallel with two farad. So total capacitance is three farads. Okay, the charge will remain the same. Now the capacitance have changed. Now voltage V is U by C. There is nothing but its value will be 3 coulombs by 3 farad, that is 1 volt. Okay, 